Often our kids have access to so many different devices and just maintaining their digital well-being is part of the battle. Today we're going to show you some nifty features that Google's Family Link has to offer, which will ultimately make life easier and put you back in control. To get started, you'll need to download Family Link to yours and your child's device. Google will then prompt you to create a username and a password, and that username will also be used as your child's email address. First up, screen time and activity reports. These let you monitor exactly how long your child is spending on their device and also on their favorite apps, and it allows you to make a decision about what they can and cannot do. When your child goes to download a new app, you'll receive a handy notification allowing you to approve or deny the request. This will also help you manage in-app purchases and you can hide app from the existing device if you don't think they're appropriate. If you need help choosing apps for your kids, then Google have a load of teacher recommended ones that you can add directly to their device and that are age appropriate. You can also set blackout periods for when it can't be used. Think bedtime or during an activity. And if all else fails, Gareth, it's time for dinner. You can just press this button and it immediately switches it off. Or you can even do this. Okay, Google, shut down Gareth's device. Last up, my favorite feature. There becomes a moment as a parent when you have to pluck up the courage and let your children be a little bit more independent. And that may include letting them walk home alone from school. Well, you can use Family Link to give you real-time location information, as long as your child has an active internet connection and the device is switched on. There are plenty of good apps out there that help with screen time, the balance of the real world and the digital one, and ensuring the apps are right for our children. So keep exploring and thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.